Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So now in our previous video, we have gone through the concept in detail about what the dominance method is and how to proceed with the questions uh, in the dominance method. So there are situations now in this in this video, I will be uh, doing a question where there is no pair of matrices given. We have to make it on our own. So there are situations where a complete written statement is given and you have to first formulate the pair of matrix and then operate whether with minimax principle to get the settle point if available and if not proceed with the dominance end up with 2 cross 2 then look for the settle or follow probability method or odds method. So our main concern in this video is formulation of pair of matrix. So I will be just helping you to formulate pair of matrix in such statement questions. Rest you have to do it the complete solution I will be just providing you the answer so now what is given in the question say it says that it is a game between two players A and B where A is maximizing underline this because maximizing means we have to put the signs as per the requirements or conditions with A considering that A is in power since it is a maximizing player B is minimizing so now what the statement says, player A wins B's coin if two coins total are odd number. So condition first, condition is what? A will get all B's coins if sum of their total Total is odd. Right? Second. And loses his coin. Understand here. And loses his coin. Loses means he, uh, A has to give the coins to now. B loses or uh, means minus. Loses means minus. Negative. Uh, wins means positive. Now second condition is A will lose coins A will lose his coin mark the words his coin lose whatever it whatever A has if total is if total yani sum that is sum of A's and B's means their total means the sum of both A and B coins if sum of their total is even so this is the main thing with which we are we will be able to formulate our matrix so now what type of coins both a and b has 1 2 5 10 50 clear so what we have to make is we have to determine the pay of matrix and then get the best strategies in the value of k so I will be doing up till here, giving you the answers for this, best strategies and value, which we have to do it on your own. So let's proceed with the formulation of pair of matrix. So now I will be, uh, now I don't need any condition, uh, any question. I just need these conditions because I have note down the summary and snapshot. Clear? So let we need to take, construct a table over here. So let's construct a table. Hmm. So it's five with the arrows and five with the uh, six. We uh, one we need extra. Yes. So here is the table. I need to move it. So let me write here total is even and erase from here. Now let's say enlist the strategies. So here will be player B, here will be player A. Player A being the maximizing so we have to look for the signs for A. Now what are the coins they are having? 
1, 2, 5, 10 and 50 as mentioned in question. Similarly, B is also having 1, 2, 5, 10 and 50. So basically these coins are mentioning the strategies. This is a B1 strategy. This is B2 strategy of having uh, two coins. This is B3 of five coins, B4 and B5. So now here it is A1 strategy, A2 strategy, A3, A4 and A5. So now let's move. First, A is having 1 and B is having 1. So 1 plus 1 is 2. 2, two is what? Even. So even means A will lose whatever A is having. So what will A is having 1? So A will lose. Next, A is having 1, B is having 2. 1 plus 2 is 3. 3 is odd. So 3 is odd means I am I will get what b is having a will get all b coins b is having two coins so a will get that getting means positive getting means positive losing means with negative sign next a1 b5 total is six even even so it means a will lose whatever a is having a is having one so a will lose one 10 plus 1 11 11 is odd odd means a will gaining will get all the coins which B is having. So it means a B is having 10, A will gain 10. A1, uh, A first is 1 and 50, 51 again odd. So A will get what B has, B is having 50, so A will getting 50. Second, now second row, A2, uh, A is having 2 coins, B is having 1, 2 plus 1 is 3. 3 is odd. B, A will get what B has. B is having 1. So A will get 1. 2 plus 2. 4. 4 is even. A will lose. A is having 2. So it will lose. 2 plus 5. 7. Odd. A will get what B has. It's 5. 2 plus 10. 12. 12 means even. A will lose what A is having. So it's minus 2. Again 2 and 50. 52 even. A will lose what is having. 5 plus 1. 6. 6 is even. A will lose. 5 plus 2, 7, A will gain what B has. Clear? Next, 5 plus 5, 10, even A will lose what he is, what A is having. 5 plus 10, 15, odd, A will gain what B is having. 5 plus 50, 55, A will gain what B is having. Similarly, 11, odd, A will get. So on the similar pattern, I am now making the payoff matrix. So is it clear to all? So if you need any assistance or coaching regarding such subject or such, you can even message me in the comment section or on the telegram link. I do take courses. So if you need any assistance, any coaching with this, I can help you out. So this is the payoff matrix. So next you better know what to do is look for the settle point. So I, I, I am telling you there is no settle point over here. So you have to proceed with the dominance method. So that is uh, that I am leaving up to you. I am telling you the solution, uh, the answer dominance, sorry. Dominance method. So dominance method, it's up to you. The operations, the value of game comes out to be zero. The strategies which A will follow, it's, uh, since there is no settle point, so it is a mixed strategy. So A will be following A1 with the strategies will be A1 will be getting 1 by 2, A2 will be 1 by 2 and rest the three strategies will be zero. Similarly for B, the strategies will be two by three, one by three, zero, zero and zero. So this is the answer which I am leaving to you to do it on your own. If you need any help, do, do tell me. Thank you.